That was quite an education, watching a master chef shop for groceries. Well, I think it's important to feel and smell the things we put inside us. I gotta tell you, if I'm smelling it, I'm not feeling it. So, um, what are we having? Well, it's a tasting menu that I call Seven Small Explosions in Your Mouth. Seven, huh? Let's see. Salty, sweet, savory, sour. Help me. Crunchy, creamy, and rudy. Ooh. What's rudy taste like? Pistachios, I've been told. But the real magic happens when we start to combine flavors. For example, take a simple cherry tomato. Squirt a little aged balsamic vinegar into its fleshy center. Cherry, squirt, fleshy. You can't help yourself, can you? It's very hard. Mmm. <laughs> it's not sweet like a tomato or sour like vinegar. Exactly. It's a third thing that didn't exist until one was driven deep inside the other. <laughs> and yes, I know what I just said. Where'd you go to culinary school? Can you keep a secret? Of course. A Denny's in Boston. <laughs> I worked the late shift. There's a lot of time to screw around. Where's the Boston accent? I dropped it. Hard to charge 60 bucks for lobster chowder with capers. Yeah. Well, where are my manners? Can I get you a glass of wine? No, thank you. I don't drink. Never? Never. Impressive. How is it that you have not killed yourself? I'm of a homicide girl. Well, then, as a good host, I won't drink either. Ah, who am I kidding? <laughs> so, why do you abstain? I'm allergic to alcohol. Every time I drink, I break out in handcuffs. Mm, pity. I have a rather remarkable collection of wine and handcuffs. You know, next to great food, beautiful women, and vintage cars, wine is what brings me the most happiness. No, actually, it's women, then food. No, wine, women. Ah, I left out pills. Pills, wine. I get the point. <laughs> Let's see how sophisticated your palate is. Hmm? Put on this blindfold. Well, I usually charge 50 bucks extra for that, but okay. <laughs> I knew I liked you. And ready? Do it. What do you taste? Hmm. Fig. Very good. Now? Try this. Mmm. Eel? And here comes the pistachios.